Hi, I'm Vanessa from SpeakEnglishWithVanessa.com. Today, you're going to see a sample conversation video lesson from the course The Fearless Fluency Club. This conversation also comes with a vocabulary lesson, a grammar lesson, a pronunciation lesson, lesson support, and much more in the full Fearless Fluency Club. So I'm going to show you part of the conversation today. You can learn a little bit with it, but if you'd like to learn more, if you want to join our wonderful community to become a fearless, fluent English speaker, you can click on the links up here or in the description below. Enjoy! Let's get started! Hey Jeff, thanks Hi, for Vanessa. coming. I'm really happy to be here. <laughs> so Jeff is my neighbor who lives downstairs mm -hmm. and he's also a professional musician. Is that how you would say it? Yeah. So sure. today he's going to talk to us about his skills, his job, his passion. Mm -hmm. And can you tell us a little bit about the guitar? I don't know, when did you start to play? I started when I was 12 um, and uh, I, I actually, I had before that my passion was skateboarding and I had broken my left arm skateboard no it's my right arm i broke my right arm and my so my arm was in a cast like this <laughs> for, perfect for like for like a, you know a while i guess it was a, couple, a few months uh -huh. and i had to like learn to write with my left hand it was really it, that's a whole other story but but while I had my arm in the cast, first of all, it was definitely making me reconsider my passion for skateboarding. It was actually this, like I dislocated my left elbow, then I broke both both bones in my right forearm. And so like here I was 12 years old, like maybe I don't want to keep breaking bones. And so there was that, but then also like it is kind of funny that my arm was stuck in this position. But I also like, I don't know, I saw a few movies that like one was this movie called Crossroads that starred Ralph Macchio and he played this this white kid who wanted to be a blues man and like there was great guitar blues throughout this throughout the show throughout the movie and when I saw that I think that really inspired me and I don't know just and I, and I actually I went to a party and there was this kid this this boy who didn't even play the guitar that well, but he was playing the guitar and all the girls at the party were like, oh my God. And I was like, I think I might, I might want to learn how to do that because girls don't talk to me. So <laughs> a good passion. <laughs> yeah. So I started playing when I was 12 and I started just taking a, a, a group guitar class at my school. My parents got me a terrible guitar because they didn't think I was going to stick with it. So they got me like this yeah. jalopy of a guitar. <laughs> and um, this guitar, this this actual guitar I bought when I was 14. Wow. So with money I earned 14. from mowing lawns and raking leaves. Yeah, I got this when I was 14. Nice, so, nice. That's um, really precious to you then. That you've had yeah, it for a long time and yeah. you got it with your own I money. Yeah, I bought, it, I bought it with my own money uh, that, that I earned from from neighborhood neighborhood parents, and I mowed their lawns and raked their leaves. Oh, that's such an inspiring story. Saved like 450 story. bucks. Whoa. Yeah. Wow. Um, at, at, I bought this when I was 14. Wow. Um, and uh, I've been, you know, I've been pretty passionate about it ever since. Yeah, it sounds like it's, once you saw the girls gathered around the guitar, yeah. there was no looking back. <laughs> yeah, and then when we, when I had a band in eighth grade, and when we played our first show, uh, can just imagine <laughs> it was really cool it was actually at a bar they had like a teen night at this really cool bar um you know where local bands really wanted to play uh. and it was like a teen night so and we had a demo tape and they they hired us to do it and so we got to play in front of like hundreds of you know screaming kids and they, and uh and really like before that i really was and still am a, like kind of a nerd and like i just i was the class clown and you know I didn't I really did not get much female attention except like oh my god Jeffrey would you stop trying to be funny <laughs> oh no this and is put on cool jeans 
And, but after this concert, after this concert, we went to like the place where teens hung out, which was this lagoon in New Orleans, like, you know, the parking lot cool next to it. And I was like, oh man, I hope I don't get beat up this time. We get out of the car and we get thronged by like the cool mean guys, you know, like the guys who did drugs when they were 14. And like, and all the hot girls were just surrounding us like, hi, hi, can we be your friends? And what like, a change! I am definitely sticking with this guitar. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yeah. Wow, especially as a 14 year old, that's yeah. really important yeah. to be liked, yeah. to be liked by girls. Yeah, I think I was 15 by that point actually, but yeah, yeah. So it was yeah. like, but then there was the added bonus that um, first of all, it's the first thing that I was ever disciplined about in my life. Mm -hmm. My parents are always trying to get me to do that. Thank you for watching this sample video lesson from the Fearless Fluency Club. I would love to help you continue to improve your English. Would you like to get full lesson sets every month and personalized feedback from me? Click the I at the top of the screen to join or click the link in the description below. You can become a fearless, fluent English speaker. Let's start now.